Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I apologize for the bad lighting. Unfortunately, it's getting much harder for me to film after work now because I come home. By the time I get home, the sun is going down. That and it was really cloudy and rainy today. So I just do not have good lighting today. But I got my package from Josh's Frogs. And I really want to do an unboxing. So we're just going to work with the bad lighting. So we're going to unbox this. I got some goodies in preparation for the bioactive setup I'm going to be doing for my Crested Gecko in the future. Um, so each paycheck I get, I'm putting some of it towards that project. So it's in the works. But everything I got from Josh's Frogs today is part of that. So I'm very excited to open it up and see everything. So of course I wanted to film and do an unboxing for you guys. So shout out to Josh's Frogs for my package that I haven't even opened yet, but I'm super excited about it. Shipping was fast, it was great, it's here, and let's open it up. All right, I'm gonna try to do this without scissors, because who needs scissors? All righty. I need to move my tripod a little bit so you guys get a good view. Give that a try. Tall box, so we're gonna make this work. Okay, so I've got my shipping receipt thinger my bobber. Lots of packaging. All right, first up, order some spring tails because you know, you can't have a bioactive setup without some spring tails and I, in the past, you guys know I've bought springtails and I'm really bad at keeping them alive. So we're gonna try this again. So I ordered a whole bunch of springtails and I ordered the Josh's Frog Spring to Life springtail food. So we're gonna give that a try because I wanted to make sure that this time I did it right as much as I could to try to keep my springtails alive. So I got their food, I got their springtails. We're gonna see if I can keep them alive this time. Let's open them up and take a peek. Oh, I see them moving. There's life. I see them. I was a little worried with it being kind of chilly today, but I do see movement. There is life. And I know sometimes they say, give it a couple of days for them to kick in, but I do see movement. So we're all good here. All right. So then the two other things I got, so I got four things. I don't want to damage them, so I'm being very careful about how I take out this packaging. I see papers. I got a thank you letter. Thanks for shopping with us. Have a wonderful day from Justin. Thanks, Justin. Oh, I've got springtail information, how to care for the springtails. See in here it says, when you get the springtails, if they're not moving, release or take off the lid because the CO2 is built up. So when you remove the lid um, and leave it open for an hour and then replace the lid and wait 24 hours and they'll be good to go again. Yeah, just awesome. I won't lose that. Maybe this time I'll be able to keep them alive. Another thank you letter. Oh, but this gives away my next thing that I'm getting. But this is from Forrest. So thanks Forrest for my little thank you letter. All right, so the next two I'm very, very excited about. I was a little worried because of the weather, but oh, let's see if I can pick this up. Lots of dirt, lots of dirt. All right, so I'm gonna bring this down so you guys can see better without me spilling it everywhere. I did get a plant for Pip's future bioactive setup. And I was worried about ordering plants online. I've never done it before. I was scared that they were gonna come in dead because of how cold it is. And they're just being stuffed in a box. But this plant looks fantastic. This plant is called the mother-in-law's tongue. Uh, so it's a lot like a snake plant or it looks like a snake plant. I don't know if it's a type of snake plant. I don't know plants very well. But on their website, they had a section where it showed you good plants for different animal enclosures. So I went to the Crested Gecko section and picked a couple. 
sent to the Crested Gecko section and you know, checked it out. And I just love the looks of this plant. And I like that it's tall because she's gonna be going into a 20 gallon long, turned sideways. So I love this plant. It is in such good shape. It looks so good. It's already super tall. I wasn't expecting it to be this tall already. So that is amazing. Okay, so this must be a test because there is a plant missing. I did get another plant and it was called something, something, but basically the human name for it, the name that I can pronounce is Zoe, which is why I had to buy it obviously, but it's not in here. So I reached out to them their customer service typically is very, very good. So I'm gonna keep you guys updated on that process. This must just be a test so we can test out their customer service as well as this unboxing video. So I'll keep you guys posted. So all in all, everything looks really good. You know, the spring tails are alive. This plant is humongous and looks beautiful. So I'm gonna do what the sheet said. I'm gonna leave my spring tails open for an hour. Um, let the CO2 kind of come out, let it air out a little bit before I put the lid back on. Yeah. Hey guys. So I wanted to give you guys an update. Um, the Josh's Frog service email did get back to me. Um, I was supposed to apparently get a slip of paper in my package that said that that plant that was missing um, was currently out of stock and that they would ship it to me as soon as they had more available. Um, unfortunately, that slip apparently didn't make it into my package, but nevertheless, they will be sending it as soon as they have another one in stock. And other than that, I'm really happy with what I got. The um, springtails are absolutely thriving. I'm thrilled. Like, they are doing so, so good. I don't know if it's that food that's making a difference compared to my last experiences, but they are doing so good. And that other plant that I got for Pip, I love it. I'm still shocked at how nice it was when it came in. Like, I was worried about, sorry, whew, slipping. I was worried about buying plants online and having them shipped to me, but that plant is, it came in perfect condition. So overall, I'm really happy with the things that I got in. Um, I'm a little upset that I don't have that other plant that I ordered, but like they said, they're going to ship it to me as soon as they have another one. So now we're just going to wait for that. I'm very excited, especially since it's called Zoe. <laughs> so now we're just waiting for that. But other than that, the things that I did get in that I ordered, I absolutely love. So shout out to Josh's Frogs. Thank you so much for sending me these things in great condition. I'm so impressed. And if you're looking for springtails or plants, I recommend Josh's Frogs because they came in great condition. So definitely go and check them out. And as always, thank you guys for watching and we'll see you for the next video.